Holy crackers. Oh, man. Alice Eve, everybody. Alice Eve. Lovely. Thank you. I'm ushering in spring. Well, it certainly arrived just in time for your lovely floral garden thing. <laughs> you look nice. It's, it's Boys don't like these kind of dresses, but girls do. Boys like them fine. Well, it's the flowers are very pretty, Chris. Yes, they are, and they're lovely, and they're, all the squiggles are nice, too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you're wearing it. Most of the time, I can't concentrate when you're out here. Everything's great. It's all contained. <laughs> it's lovely. This film looks a bit scary. I know. You looked very scared in your acting that you did. That wasn't acting. That was genuine scared. Oh, that was hamming. I, how dare you? Ha Do it again. You, you looked like you were sort of coming out of a pool of water and <laughs> gasping for air. Like a little tadpole. That's right, is it? <laughs> Do you have a good time making this movie? Do you come here often? All the time. I work here. <laughs> How about you? I'm just new in town, actually. Yeah, I can tell. You don't talk like this. No. I sound a bit like Mo Sislak from Pakistan. <laughs> or Larry King. Hey, um... What accent is Brian doing in that, in that movie? He's doing Russian. Ah, I thought that's what it was. <laughs> it's good. Ukrainian, perhaps? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's happening in the movie then. Does he, uh, like, he goes nuts and breaks the joint up? Well, no, he tries, but I play quite a tough cookie, so uh, I hold my own against him. Do you, uh, do you do it in American or English? Yeah, I do it in American, and I had to speak in American the whole time I was there. How did it go? Well, I wasn't allowed to speak in English ever at all, even to my parents or my brothers or my friends, so I lost all my brothers and my friends and my parents. And uh, do they all hate America? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> all of your brothers and friends and parents hate the United States they of America. They wouldn't call me anymore because I'd sort of answer the phone and be like, hey, how you doing? And they were like, what's wrong with you? Why are you an American? Yeah, do the American accent again. I liked it. Hey, how you doing? That's very good. I don't know why I go an octave lower to do that. Let's do it again. Hey, how are you? Um, what's up, Mom? Why are you talking like that, darling? What, what, is it, what is it that you're talking like that for, darling? Um, I'm just sitting next. <laughs> Could we have a call? Sure. Be careful, though. It, it sometimes... I wonder if it will ring. Oh! oh, oh I wonder who it is. You have to answer it, then. Well, hi, Mom. Oh, hello, Alice, darling. Why are you talking like that? Because there's this bossy man here who makes me talk in this accent the whole time that I'm on this stage with this horse and this man. I don't talk to me. Wait, hold on. Let me talk to your mother. <laughs> Mrs. Eve, I'm outraged that you would even think such a thing. Plus the fact I also met you before, years ago. Do you remember? <laughs> yes, of course I remember, yes. I met you and your lovely husband at the Groucho Club. I'm sorry I was a bit drunk and was sick on your dress. <laughs> Oh, well, take that, Seth. <laughs> Bye, Mom. Bye. Bye. Very good. Bye. I'm still here. All right. <laughs> That's <Yeah>. about right. <laughs> <laughs> Have you done a big uh, root and toot and shoot? Oh, you did uh, <laughs> Star Trek, yeah. That made some money. Yeah, made a little bit of money. That was a good film. Yeah, J.J. Abrams. Yeah, he's clever, isn't he? He's very, very clever. Yeah, bastard. You're clever, too. <laughs> Not so much. If I was clever, I'd have worked my way out of here by now. No, you're very clever. You channel it differently. You're a, a personality, and he's a, you know, artist. filmmaker. Yeah, artist. But this is an art form, isn't it? I... <laughs> I think it is. It's is not it... easy. You're good at it. Yeah, I don't, I don't know that that means it's an art form. I think it's more just... A, a skill. Ca it's a convention, I think. The late night show is a convention. You've been on the other ones, haven't you? Yeah. Well, you know the what best. they're like. They're, they're, oh, they're, I, I totally agree this is the best one, hands down. But the... Uh, <laughs> please. Do you know, I have to 
say, I'm just looking at Brian uh, on the cover of this thing. He, he looks very frightening. He and... turned it around. What? There we go. <laughs> That's Brian looking frightening. He was quite frightening. He was quite a strong dude as well, like when he had to do stuff and he, was, he had a firm grip. But it worked for the story. Well, he, he's, uh, he was uh, Malcolm's dad and Malcolm in the middle. <laughs> No. And then Breaking Bad. Yeah, Breaking Bad. Yeah, Breaking. Did you watch that? I did. I had to stop watching it when I was working with him, though, because it would have been a bit, you know, a conflict of interest. That's a great show. It's That's a great a really show. really good show, and he looks good in underpants. Yeah, he does. Yeah. He takes care of himself. He runs a lot. We does ran. He? We'd run together. Do you run? Every now and then. Only with Brian Cranston? Only with Brian. Only if Brian's down there in the gym sweating. <laughs> Jeff? I like the way you talk, girl. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Jeff. I like that dress. It's got like lattice work on it. <laughs> I knew this dress would take some. Work that lattice, Alice. <laughs> I'm feeling a bit left out. No, sorry. Actually, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. About that. sorry. Anyway, it's commercial break time, Alice. Okay. Bye. No. 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 <laughs> We're back. Welcome back, everybody. I'm here with Alice Eve, uh, who's in this very good film, Cold, Cold Comes the Night. Very good. That was very good. Is that music in your film? No, but um, thank God. <laughs> hey, uh, what music do you like? I've never asked you. Oh, do that's you enjoy a really it? good question. Is it? Well, then I'm never know... asking it again. Okay. Do you know who I bought? Okay, first of all, I like the XX. That's the band that I think is the most you, interesting band. You bet, band. yes. Um... Okay, okay. A lot Easy of bands, with a... Jamie. And then I also just bought this band on recommendation of my friend called... The... Oh, no, he's not a band. He's a, a... I guess he's an R&B artist, which I think is coming back. Um, Has it been away? Well, in the 90s, it was so good, you know, yes. with a liar and all the... A lot of female R&B artists in the 90s, but I think it's coming back, and this guy, The Weeknd, is really good. Uh, I, so I just listened to his album. All right. Well, hey, no, no, just don't applaud just because she likes music. Lots of people like music. No, that guy liked The Weeknd in red. Yes, OK. Yeah, you, yeah. I, I think he might be just trying to get your attention. He got it. <laughs> I, I like whatever you like, Alice. You got a pretty mouth. <laughs> Yeah. But I think that the, the lord among men when it comes to music is George Harrison. Oh, yes, my goodness. Lovely George, God rest him. He was lovely. If you don't know where you're going, Craig, any road will take you there. Yeah, that's a bit advanced for me. <laughs> <laughs> Alice Eve, everybody. We were out. name that is Boyana. Is that Serbian by any chance? Oh, it is. Wow, you read your card. I can't <laughs> believe it. No, I, because during the commercial break, I went out and I said, welcome. And I said, Boyana, that's a lovely name. And she said, it's Serbian. And I said, oh, you're from Serbia or something. And then you said, I didn't read my cards. Yeah, you didn't. I really want to look at this. Mm. Wow. <laughs> talk, talk. Yeah, that's oh. right. Oh, look, you've got tattoos on your... So do you. I do. I have, have a lot of them. It looks like a naughty one, that one. No, 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 not at all. It's very patriotic. It's a little oh. bit naughty because it's on me, but the... Uh... <laughs> How many do you have? Just the two? Three, this one, too. Oh, that must have hurt. Really like, did. yeah, my Lord. It did. In the palm of your hand? Yeah. How drunk were you? I was actually stone cold sober. Really? And heartbroken. Oh. Mm. Yeah, the pain helps. <laughs> I love the snake, snake cup. I was excited to meet the snake cup. <laughs> the snake cup is excited to meet you? Well, and Jeff, where's Jeff? Oh, there you oh, go. Hello there, my dear. How hello. are you? 
Zdravo, zdravo. Oh, Jeff, kako si? Yeah. I didn't know you spoke Serbian. Sure I do, yeah, yeah, fluently, fluently. Oh, really? Uh, say something else yeah. in Serbian, then. Yeah, uh, tacos el carbon. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, Serbians. Thank you. Jeff's, Jeff's so funny. Yeah, your accent sounds a little bit Australian, to be honest. I have to be. It's... We did move to Australia when I was seven. Ah, I see. Which part of Australia? We moved to Sydney and then I moved to Melbourne. Have you been? I have, but at both places I really liked Melbourne. Me I did quite too. like Sydney as well, but Melbourne, my lord. So good. Lots of punks in Melbourne. I think they keep. I was one of them! <laughs> now you're in a suit. Just yes, like yes, but underneath the suit, naughty tattoos and the heart of punk rock. Do you have any other tattoos? Yes. Mm. <laughs> I, I was really drunk. <laughs> no, I would never get my, you know... Where did you get your tattoos, then? Um, On your arms? No, but, I mean, where did you get them? In New York. Oh, right. Oh, God, I hope he's not watching. Who? The guy who did this one. Why? I fell in love with him when he did it. And then he did this one, and it says, Can't get rid of you, and then he broke up with me. <laughs> wait, wait. You got tattoos done by a lover? Yeah. Well, he wasn't my... <laughs> Really? Yeah. Well, gosh, that's brave. And then we broke up and then I got this one. Yeah, but that must be tough. Because then it's on you. Well, it, oh no, I love them. Okay, really yeah, no, fair enough. Yeah. I don't well, regret a single one. Right, all right. What are you doing with that card now? I'm just seeing what you've been told to talk. I'm just, I've always been intrigued watching right. your show, what the cards say. Because people work and they, they yeah, work Yeah, they actually up work them. I tear them up every night. Yeah, I know, I know. And I... And I kind of just thought it would be nice to mention, you know, that people work hard to write the They cards. do, and, and you know, their work is deeply appreciated. My thanks. <laughs> my thanks to all of the people who write on these cards every night. I only reason I tear them up is to express my disdain for the job and the medium. <laughs> that's all. Oh, but you're, you've got it. No, don't pack that. Don't pack that. You have, you have the best, this is the best talk show. I, I think it's a great talk show, you but can, that's like you being, curse. you know, can that's like curse? being the, the, you know, the, the tallest midget. I mean, so, so what? No, you're lucky. No, I like this show, I you, do. You curse and they put a little flag over your mouth, they let you curse. Do you, do you I curse? Grumble. Yes. Hey, caramba! <laughs> She's Serbian! Clap that! Clap She's that. Serbian! She's Serbian and then Australian, she doesn't understand our ways, let her talk! <laughs> you're a racist man, double racist, Serbia and Australia. <laughs> Have you, ever, have you ever been back to Serbia? Oh, I didn't even see that you were there, sorry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah, yeah, no, come on. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. But I appreciate the work you do. He didn't do these, did he? No, no, oh. he doesn't do these. He's way above that. He oh. tells people to do these. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. And they're like, but he tears them up every night and he says, you better do them. <laughs> Let's, no, no, let's see, hang on. Rake. Oh, well, no, we did that. You yeah, Rake. You never Rake's... talk about people's shows. Yeah, I do. do. Tell, tell me about oh, Rake. Oh, my is, God, is they're it... going to love me for bringing that up. Rake. Yeah, yeah, Rake. Is, is it any good? Yeah. There you are, then. You should watch it. I've seen them all. It's on... really great. Are they on uh, TV? And you know what? I'm not just saying that. Oh, yes, it's on TV. <laughs> you know, I'm allowed to say <laughs> I, no, no, it. No, no, no. Yeah, it's on Fox. Yeah. I already said it. 9 p.m. Thursday night. 9 p.m. Thursday night. Yeah, you know, it's so fun. I was, I, was, I was really nervous about having to talk about it because, you know, most people... I really wish they had like an like a like a an honesty meter when people talked about oh, who they do, work with. Oh, you do. You don't want. No, to have I that. do because do you know what? Because like me talking about Rake, everything would be honest. The honest truth. It's such a good group of people to work. Well, who like Kinnear? Yes. Oh, do you know? No. Uh, he's been no. here a couple of times. No, I need to say something. I need to say something. He's in lovely. Honor. He's May lovely. I? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't know. He was ill. Very ill. Was he? Yes. Okay. Very, very sick on set. And he stayed on set to work. I do a live show every Wednesday night. I'm about to go and do it after this. Really? Where? You're my warm-up act. Um, oh. where, where do you do your live show? At the three clubs. Now we're talking about my show and Rex is going to kill me. I'm promoting a different show. Uh, no, it's, it's all right. <laughs> I, 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 it's fine. I do, it's kind of like this. Really? Yeah, you do I, a talk show? Yeah, no, no. It's called The Blind Date Project. I go on a Blind Date Project, yeah. eh? What kind of a blind date are we talking about, sister? Oh, is this for real? Yeah, I'm cleaning. Hang on, is this board music or is this like no? Go it's on it's no, music? it's it's noir. It's noir music. I've you, never done you, a talk show. You need to be very nice to me. I'm a talk show. Have you show never done a talk show? Yeah, be gentle. Well, this isn't really a talk show. <laughs> oh, this you can't, you can't is. See me. He's not a real horse. <laughs> okay, go on. <laughs> I've been waving and he's yes, not. Yes, he's not. Back. He's not there. Okay. The Sorry, only people are here are it. you and me and the skeleton, baby. So what were we, what were we talking about? 
Are we talking I, about my show? No, or we're talking about your show, the three it's of like clubs, a, or okay, something. Okay, so it's a fully improvised hour. I have no idea how that would work. Me, it works. You should be a guest. You should be my date, Craig. You should come and be my date on it. Oh, it's a that's fully what, improvised yes. hour. It's called the Blind Date Project. I go on a blind date with a different actor or performer every week. And directions are sent to us via text messages and phone calls. And it's an improv show that lasts an hour in a karaoke bar. And we sing. There's no set ending. And what happens is... I'll do it. <laughs> I'll do it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hold you to it. I'll do it. <laughs> You'd be it's just great. the kind of thing that I like. It expresses... No, no, Contempt for the <laughs> format, and I like that. Which format? I have no idea. <laughs> my feet aren't even touching the ground. I'm so sure. Oh, do you want to so big? Uh, oh my god, my mind. the Tom Cruise still. Hold on. Oh, thanks. Uh, ah, anyway, Rake's amazing because Greg was really <laughs> ill, and he. Uh, yeah. Thanks. Thank we you. keep that in case Tom Cruise is ever on. Yeah. Yeah. He's my height. Maybe, maybe now that he sees that it works. Yeah, don't worry, up. Tom. We're we're set up for you. <laughs> oh, we gotta, we have to go. We're way over. Sorry. Really? Yeah. Way over. I'll talk to you more right, on your the uh, be... show. Oh, do we have to do the commercial break now? Yes. Oh, you will come. You'll come and do my show. But Shoot. you don't play yourself. You play a character. No. Oh. Tutsi frutsi. <laughs> oh, you can play yourself then. You can I'll play... do it. Okay, great. All right then. But I play a character. All right, go to a commercial break. I... Oh, let's go. Well, wait. Who's oh, your character? Her name's... Oh, it doesn't matter. She changes. So according to who... I'm not allowed to know that it's you either, right? I don't know who it is. So I'll put you in touch with my people and then we'll figure it out. We'll be right back, everybody. We'll be right back.